In this video, we're going to look at examples of setting up linear models. For our first example, a salesperson earns a base salary of $450 per month, plus a 5% commission on their total sales for the month. Find a linear model to represent the monthly income I in terms of sales S. So we have our two variables, and what we know is that I, the income of the salesperson, can be found by taking the base salary, so this person gets a base salary regardless of whether they have any sales or not, so that's going to be a constant 450 no matter what, plus 5% commission on their total sales for the month. So if we're going to use a percent in a problem, we have to convert it to either a decimal or a fraction. Usually people prefer decimal, so 5% as a decimal, that means we would need to divide by 100 or we move the decimal two places to the left, so it'd be 0 0.05. So it'd be 0 0.05, he gets 5% on the sales, he or she, so we'll put an S right there. And this is it. That would be the linear model to represent the situation given. In our next example, a cable company charges a flat rate of $15 per month plus $5.99 for each on-demand movie ordered. Write a linear model that calculates a total monthly cost C as a function of the number of movies on demand M. So for this one, Let's see, it's going to be C, our monthly cost, and how is the monthly cost determined? The flat rate of $15, so we're charged $15 whether we watch any movies or not, plus $5.99 for each movie ordered, which we're calling M. And that's it. That would be the linear model to represent that situation.